The State Department of Environmental Services has notified us that we have been dropped from further consideration on an application for funding uh, dealing with the replacement of the culverts on uh, under High Street at the grist mill. Mm -hmm. This is the second one we've been we've been uh, replaced on and, and 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 not been allowed to participate in. Um, I gave you all a letter which the chairman discussed a moment ago that we're going to place on the website. And I, I did have an, an hour and a half meeting today with the Department of Public Works on that letter and the requirements behind it. And I'm concerned uh, that because we had a, a group of people come in mm -hmm. and address what they conceived to be a problem, and, and very well may, may, may be from their perspective that the state has uh, dropped any further consideration of assisting us uh, in, in anything dealing with the dam until we physically remove it. Mm. So. But we are continually monitoring things up there. I will tell you that I, when I talked to Public Works this morning, um, I asked them pointedly about whether or not the weepage in the dam that's been identified by the, the state uh, is still ongoing, and the answer was no. Since we dropped the dam to the 97.3 feet elevation uh, for the water level, uh, the seepage has stopped. So. Uh, there's no further danger to seepage through the, through the walls of the dam at this point, which I think is very good. We just need to continue to work on uh, the completion of the things that are on the state's checklist. And Public Works has notified me as soon as they get rid of the massive uh, poison ivy inf infection up there on the, uh, the north side of the dam, that they'll be up there finishing that work and getting that done, and they'll have the state approve it as soon as it's finished. We're probably going to take care of the poison ivy tomorrow, and they'll be working within the next week or two to get the remainder of the dam done. Okay. 